Good evening. Welcome to our first uh, session of Supernatural Fiction. This is um, just to welcome you to the class. My name is Nicole Miller. Um, I have a long history with ghost stories. I have been uh, reading them um, since I was little and uh, I think it all goes back to A Christmas Carol and Charles Dickens who um, became the subject of um, my PhD. So um, I am bringing my Victorian background to bear on some of uh, the readings that we will be doing for this course. And in my um, introduction to this week, um, I will be talking about how the Victorians are really um, foundational to the ghost story, even as it's written today. So um, we are going to go to the 19th century in order to draw our elements, um, which you will be incorporating every week um, into exercises and um, your own uh, short story drafts. Um, welcome um, to um, this Grub Street workshop. I'm actually broadcasting from Glasgow, Scotland um, in, uh, on a very chilly, rainy evening. Um, in October, um, leading up to All Hallows Eve. So our setting is uh, absolutely uh, rife for the ghost story. Um, and um, I think uh, we will have members of the class um, logging in from the East Coast, from Boston, where Grub Street is based, but probably all over uh, the country and possibly um, the world. So some people could be in my time zone. Um, but every uh, week on Wednesdays, you will have a new lesson posting. Um, so check uh, for that through Wet Ink, and then there will be prompts um, for you to do and readings. Um, those two will be generally linked. The prompts will be inspired uh, by the readings. And then in um, weeks three through six, you will be submitting um, full ghost stories, um, full short ghost stories, and uh, the best stor ghost stories often are short. Uh, so hopefully the word limit um, will help you uh, sort of contain um, the uh, most, uh, most fearsome elements. Um, and that those will be due um, on the third week Wednesday, the fourth week Wednesday, the fifth week Wednesday, sixth week Wednesday. So you will be split into two groups for those sets of stories. And I um, am looking forward to reading them and critiquing them. I just wanted to go through um, a, uh, a few um, things about the syllabus so that you know what's coming in terms of our subject matter or topics, um, some of the authors that we'll be reading. Uh, there could be more that um, are added to the course every week. Uh, do read um, as much as you can of, of, the, of the stories that have been posted. Um, and for the prompts, uh, I would be um, happy if you tried two or three and also critiqued each other um, for two, two of those uh, every week. Um, so this week we are going to begin with um, Dickens and the Signalman, um, M.R. James and the Doll's House, L.P. Hartley, W.S. Those are our stories. This We will have an introduction to the Victorian ghost story, what that um, entails. Then in week two, Haunted Settings and Atmosphere, um, Shirley Jackson, The Haunted House. Uh, some of our authors will be um, Robert Eichmann, uh, Ring in the Changes, Jane Gardam, The Meeting House, Shirley Jackson, The Haunting of Hill House. That's a novella, so just excerpts um, for the reading. And uh, Haruki Murakami, The Mirror. Um, week three, our topic will be time and memory. Um, and that uh, will involve how uh, you handle time in the ghost story. Muriel Spark is one of our authors. Thomas Burke, I'm not sure um, how many of you will know him, but he wrote a, a great story called Yesterday Street, and that will be included. Rosemary Timberley's Christmas Meeting, um, likewise. Uh, she's not well known uh, these days. She was a mid 20th century author, she's very spooky. She wrote a story called Harry, which I recommend. Um, Kate Atkinson, Temporal Anomaly. And that will be the same week. So the 
that your first story will be due for half of the class on the 24th. Um, and then you'll have one week uh, to read um, the stories and critique um, the first set that come in. Week four, psychic phenomena, psychological disturbance, um, dreams and the uncanny. This involves Freud, seance, um, the mind in uh, the ghost story, which really uh, comes into play at the end of the 19th century with Henry James. So Henry James, the friend of the friends is one of our stories. Joyce Carol Oates, um, Annie Prue, uh, D.H. Lawrence, and then on the 30th of October, the second set of your stories um, should be coming in with uh, our class on doubles. And, and then our, then we have our class on doubles and revenants. A revenant is um, a, a living person um, who's been possessed by a ghost from the past. And that those are um, always very interesting stories. We will be reading Penelope Fitzgerald, Elizabeth Taylor, Henry James, Angela Carter, Robert Louis Stevenson. So um, that's a hefty week. And then uh, your second set of um, critiques will be um, due then. So you'll have one full round of your own stories and then another coming in 6th of November, um, round two for uh, the first group to submit their stories to the class. And we will move on to um, the ghost in the machine. Our final class will be on where ghosts appear in the stories of um, our contemporaries, the 21st century, how technology has changed the nature of the ghost story somewhat. Um, it's always been there. It starts with Dickens and the Signalman this week. So you will see connections, I think, between what he was doing and what um, Joe Hill does in the 20th century ghost. Uh, Kazu Zuguru, the gourmet Hilary Mantel terminus. Um, I will also look at Graham Greene. So um, that is a quick brush over the syllabus. It appears in your resources. Resources will also show um, articles that are relevant um, and uh, to do check those out um, and your critique guidelines. So for how to read each other's writing and talk about it in a productive way um, I will be uh, part of guiding the critique, but I think those those uh, sort of rules for critique are helpful to get started. And then um, at the end of our course, I'll be uploading bibliography to resources, which will include more stories, more authors, your recommendations as well, and a list of um, journals that are interested in ghost stories and prizes as well. Um, so thank you for, um, for joining and uh, if um, you have watched the whole of this video, move on to our, our first lesson um, and I will uh, be talking about the Victorians. Thank you.